Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Surviving Mars. Now we are on, uh, what is it, Sol 168 already. Uh, in the last episode we got the, what is it, the mission goal, uh, research 9 breakthrough, technologies done which uh, rewarded us with 3 billion. And uh, this means we, we can finally start buying uh, some electronics and probably machine parts as well. Now, I've already gone ahead and sent the um, rocket to Earth a few, quite a few souls ago. Actually, it was only three. Um, I, I think we got the last breakthrough done uh, just maybe like a half a soul before the rocket um, reached Earth. Uh, so, I think... Um, I kind of want to buy it now. Let's see, what, what are the prices? 180 million for five. Oh, that's daylight robbery over there. That's okay, we can we can do this, but uh, let's have a look at this story over here. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Uh, it's let's a check rough this life out. here on Mars. Oh, right. You can't the founder, prepare for addiction. The founder, Hilder uh, Bederson, has the alcoholic trait. Mm. Um, alcohol is not the answer. Yeah, sometimes it is, though. Anyways, um, okay. Cool. So uh, let's let's see where where were we with things? Um, stuff is going. Food situation thirty two. That means we've just made the harvest. Uh, let's see seventy two percent on the soil quality. That is very beautiful. Now uh, let's see what else we've got. A couple of children. So our population is up to nineteen now, which is very nice indeed. And seems the kids are living in the in the nursery now. Uh, I think, let's see, do we need to, do we have any renegades? Oh, we can't really check that because we don't have the, the security station. Uh, let me just start speeding up the time a little bit and uh, maybe we do bring the rocket back. I mean, I don't think we need to buy any polymers, we can just produce them on our own, so that is fine. We'll definitely want to bring in electronics. Oh, that is so expensive. That hurts a lot. Okay, so we spelled uh, sp <laughs> spending a billion on that. Let's see. We I, I don't think we need any... Bo oh, actually... No, that's a billion. How much does it cost to build wrong button? Uh, let's see. Uh, production... Oh, it doesn't tell us. Okay, let's 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 see from here. Electronics factory. Oh yeah, well it's 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 fifteen electronics. Uh, it was a billion. Uh, to import it. Come on, get away back to this screen. So fifteen of those. Okay, so we we, we would save half of this money. So let's let's do this again. So let's do thirty um, forty five of electronics, I think. Then, and what else? Let's see, machine parts, yep, of course. So that brings us to 51, uh, maybe maybe a few more. We did need a lot more electronics though for constructing the, um, if we need more scrubbers, which we definitely need, some MTS, but I definitely need to save like 15. I think this should be good. 40 of those, 66. Let, let's just do it. Final, final check. Okay, so to make the machine, okay, for the machine parts factory, we only need two electronics. This uses electronics. Yeah, I think we're gonna go for more electronics. So what was it like sixty? Uh, no. I think that's the sort of ratio we wanna go for. Yeah, let's do that. So we're going to leave um, at least 387 million in the bank, just in case there is another another um, storyline. Now that I see those... Hmm, getting more drone... No, no, let's not do that. Let's leave the money and let's just launch it before I buy anything else. Yeah, let's do that. So it's done. So that we can't buy anything, anything else for the time being. Wait, how is our research up... Oh, we have a genius colonist. Oh, I totally missed that. Oh, that is amazing. Wait, who... Who's a genius? 
Um, milestones, command center, colonists. Oh, who solar is a genius? Did I? I remember bringing in. Well, at least that shows someone. Oh, it's a newborn. It's not a founder. Wait. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Ah, oh, well, maybe I miscounted or can't see them. He doesn't look like a newborn. He's youth. Anyways, okay, well, it's it's great to have a genius. Uh, an extra 150 sure helps us. Uh, wrong shortcut again. H for research. And we got things going here as well, so that is good. Power loss. I bet it's over here. Oh, uh, training 40. Okay, I'm thinking maybe we'll build another accumulator. Soon. Uh, let's speed up the time as well. Uh, there we go. I don't think we're losing any power in... Well, as I say that... It does seem we are losing a little bit of power over here. Which is okay. I do think, however... Sector scan. We need we can open them up as well. Now the sector scanned. So let's... Let's queue up... This one perhaps, or maybe this one. And our transporter is, is still busy over here. Just look at the amount of resources here. Uh, wait, let's let's go out so we can actually see. 104 metals, polymers. Yeah, that's that's not bad at all. And over here, I think we had loads in here as well. 103 metals, 12 polymers. And 126 metals and 13 polymers. Oh, wow. We can just get so many polymers. Ooh, 211 metals and 23 polymers. Wow, this area over here, well, it, ha it has been hammered by the, by the meteors, but just look at this. All these resources over here. And they're all ours. Well, one day. It's, uh, it's going to take a lot of work to, to get them all to our base. But, um, all right, so let's, uh, let's start planning this... Uh, out a little bit more as well. I think production-wise we are doing okay. Let's see. Water is good. We're producing 7.5. Demand is 2. And right now... Production is 174. So we're producing extra... What is it? Like almost 80. Or, or 80 power. And training about 40 at night. So, so that's alright. Now, can we send you on any missions? What do we have? Wait, we have more meteors. Yeah, why not? There you go. Alright, so the drones should be starting to, to load up the rocket over there. Now, a little bit worried, but not overly worried, I guess. Is what I'm trying to say about those dust devils over here. Um, now, let's see. Population... Ooh, 21. Six babies now. And three of them are youth. So that means we have an extra... extra nine people here. We are gonna run out of spaces for for living fairly fairly soon I think all right so two of them have grown up or yeah they're ready to work somewhere so I'm thinking uh, having one at night time here and maybe another here oh wait actually no let's uh wrong button there we go and do we need to work this overtime? I'm not so sure. Well, maybe we'll do it overtime once we have the uh, outside ready. When it comes to space in here, we, we have space for up to 28. Ooh, another one. Okay, so we can put another one 
I think over here for the time being. And maybe just maybe we will also build this now. Yeah. Let's do that. Let's get this built. So then we can start getting some Okay. Um ground uh what is it the uh, rare metals and then um, i do want to get our production lines going as well for maybe polymers and stuff we don't need them desperately right now i do want to get into electronics like asap though yeah so we'll start uh, uh turn it off and we'll have to, okay, we'll have to connect you up with some power. So, can we, can we just draw it from here? Like so? I think so, yeah. Yeah, seems to be working. Now, the next thing... We'll have to reorganize this in here. So, let's Sector destroy you. Scanned. How can we build that connection, the passage from uh, one zone to another? No, oh, you. Oh no. We may lose our transport. Wait, it hasn't started. Okay, we, we're gonna have to do this. No, wrong one. You. I'm very sorry, but we have to go. We have to get him, get him out of here before the meteor storm. Uh, comes in in about one soul. I think we should be fine with the with all this stuff over here not being maintained for a second at least. They have enough food. Yes, they too. Although that is maintenance very soon. Well, it needs maintenance now, but uh, we need to rescue our transporter first. Now I'm Research hoping. Research complete. Nice. Okay, so. Lower penalty on the uh, uh, on the work. Nice. So that is very close to forty now. The bomb. Uh, hmm. Don't remember what's gonna happen. We are gonna have to check this out now. Let's uh, choose another research now. Since we have so much fuel. Oh, that takes ten machine parts. Well, never mind. By the time we get this researched, I think um, we we might already have some machine production, machine parts uh, production as well. So, I do want to start uh, terraforming the atmosphere or the or the Mars a little bit. Uh, particularly, start with the with the atmosphere. Those CO two um, processors will be very handy. Okay, so you, let's go back back to here because I think we need some maintenance. Yeah. All right, so you go back and let's do this again. Take everything, please. Bring it back over there. Okay, I think uh, let's let's. Oh, okay, there we go. Uh, the bomb. Unbelievable amount of unaccounted funds has suddenly appeared in our accounts, but are currently kept uh, frozen. This comes shortly after we received the following cryptic message. Seth requires permission to test the, the bomb at a safe distance from your Martian colony. These funds should cover inconvenience. Does Seth have permission? Okay, what is this? Uh, yeah, some kind of choke disregard. Uh, the colony can use additional funds. Answer yes. Follow the message and identify the sender to it now. Safe distance. Um, I think that was the story that brings in the dust storm. And that means our water production is going to be off, which is okay. Electricity, however. Hmm, four souls without... Uh, the train was about 40. We should be able to survive. So yeah, let's take the uh, the funds. All right, so they've uh, it's been, it's been uh, set off. There's a Mars quake and... Yeah. Oh, dust storm. Only for a soul and Media 12 hours. Incoming. Uh, but what is worrying, though, is this over here. Right on top of our colony. Okay, the MDSs are doing double time. 
I am worried about this rover, however. Meteor incoming. That one's fine. Oh, although we are gonna lose that fuel. Yep. Resources are low. What do you mean? We got loads in here. Meteor incoming. Ah, another fuel depot. Well. Oh, we got. Wait, what? Meteor that, incoming. Did that really give us. I'll direct it. Please take it before it lands. Nice. Okay, that is good. Uh, that is all fine. Very close to harvesting this as well. Where's our transporter? Okay, you're still harvesting stuff over here. Okay. Um, I think we should be able to survive this. Seems like most of them aren't hitting us directly anymore. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, I'm not worried about the dust storm because it's only for it was only for like a sol and a half. So, and we, uh, thanks to those uh, huge uh, water tanks, we will be absolutely fine. However, those meteors. I think Anomaly we should be found. fine as well. Nice. Okay, what are we researching right now? Do we want to speed this up? Yes, new genes. Uh, we will definitely Meteor take... incoming. Here, okay. Uh, another fuel depot. Just... Okay. Uh, yeah, let's send him out. Uh, let's see if we can... Meteor incoming. Grab it before Sector meteor scan. comes down. Anomaly found. Another anomaly over here. A breakthrough. That is amazing. So once we get this one uh, scanned meteor over there. Incoming. Another one. Oh, direct one. Really hoping the MDS will take care of this one as well. Nice. Okay. Very good. And almost halfway there. Okay, dust storm is almost done. Just another nine hours and the meteor storm and 22 hours left. So seeing how things are going um, right now, I, I think we'll be... Analyzed. Ooh, that was close. Very close. Too close. Come back over here. Okay, we're, <laughs> we're gonna wait with the... Uh, um, Breakthrough one. I Meteor don't want to. Uh, that's like the fourth one now. Fourth depot we're losing. Oh, and another meteor, meteor storm. Incoming. <laughs> oh no. There's loads of them coming in now. Oh, the timing. Oh, we're getting hammered. Oh, Jesus. That one's done. A thousand over here. Thirty-seven percent. Oh, Meteor just look incoming. at all those markers. Okay, so dust storm is done. Anomaly found. Oh, another one of those. That is beautiful. Meteor incoming. Uh, let's see. Okay. Who? The dome is safe now. That's what matters the most. Meteor incoming. Okay, um, we will be fine. I think with uh, this rocket, we'll just land it over here. So uh, then we'll have the resources closer to the dome as well. Now, let's see. I think now is the now is a good time. I hope to send you out and pray that we're not gonna be hit by one of those meteors. I think they're they've lost interest in our base now and they're starting to move move more more towards uh, east or or northeast of us. So let's send you out over there. Anomaly found. Get that breakthrough and another anomaly. Okay, beautiful. Uh scanning those two will definitely get us very close to the to some better better crop types. 
And with you, I think we'll we'll land you over here as well. And seeing how um, these two meteor storms that uh, came down on our our base over here or our colony, uh, let's call it a colony now, since we I mean, since we do have some people living here, um, since those two meteor storms didn't really affect us too much, I, I want to say, I think we can pretty much send him out right away. Yeah, I just want to get those anomalies. Was there any more? Oh, there's two more over here. Okay, so in that case, let's take the furthest ones first. So once you're done, grab this one. Then grab this one. Oh, wait, I think Sector I sent him. Scanned. Okay, yeah, I think I sent him um, already back to base. So once the breakthrough is scanned, and we'll know what it is. I'll uh, breakthrough discovered. Reset. There we go. This one. Scan that anomaly, and then once you're done, to come to play. Um, back to back to our colony. Breakthrough discovered. Core rare metals. Right. So that means some more underground rare metals. I'm really hoping once we um, research this one, we'll find some more rare metals that are closer to our our domes as well, so we can take a full full advantage of those just like uh, what what happened with this uh, water one over here i mean 500,000 water that is also very high grade that is just amazing i mean we could we don't even need those um, moisture vaporators anymore if i really wanted to i could just get rid of them and live off uh, this uh, this one uh, water source here now where's the Oh, in here. Water extractor. Right, so it doesn't require any people. It does take uh, machine parts for maintenance, but we, we could just put a scrubber next to it. So, that's how we can manage that. Where's... Um... Alright, you're still traveling, okay. Good. Very good. So, if we get, like, another 2,000 research points from there... Uh, okay, so we're halfway through, so that means we have about between 3,000 to 3.5k research points left. Uh, so, okay, it, it's not gonna get us get us the next uh, research done, but it's gonna get us very close. And with 850 uh, RP point, uh, RPs per, per de uh, soul, I think um, we'll have it very, very soon. Okay, so now the... Production numbers are looking pretty nice as well. We've gone over over the 40 mark, which is the optimal harvest. We've, we've got 42.2. I do think... Oh, wait, 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 wait. We have four people that don't have jobs. It is time to start working, working this shift here. And uh, now, power-wise... Let's see. If it's not if it's during daytime. Anomaly I think we're analyzed. okay. Okay, here's a thousand bringing us to seventy-two percent. Uh, right, so we got four people working here. And one point six per soul. Two point one per soul now. So that's gonna take us. Oh. Almost three hundred souls. Hmm. Oh yeah, it's a low crate, that's why. Ah, oh, bummer. No. Oh. Okay, we're gonna go and have to rescue RC Explorer number two. That means we are leaving Cold everything wave approaching. here. Cold wave in 2.5. Um with cold wave sector scan okay, anomaly we're gonna have found. to expand but i think we're fine another breakthrough over here Ooh, that is beautiful that is very nice indeed and then let's complete this area over here and then we can just do the the final plateau over here um i'm glad it wasn't a meteor 
but I think we do have to keep an eye on this uh, drone commander going in over here. Because uh, we, 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 we can't have this. Wait, what do I do? How do I put it back on the... Uh. Hmm. Well, somehow I removed him from the quick bar from here. And I can't see... Uh, how do you put it back on the hot bar? I'm not sure. Okay, well, I'll, I'll figure <laughs> figure it out somehow. Um, but for the time being, let's uh, let's just make sure that we get it fixed, and then, okay, let's pause for a second. Let's task you back over here. Oh, that's why we're fine. I mean, there are no drones, but it's still covered. I thought why they we don't have those indicators that there are um, no no uh, drones Sector nearby. Scanned. Okay, so that's done. You scan this, then come and take the breakthrough, and after that, come to base. Okay, cool. And the wow. Okay, there's a, there's a lot in here as well. So I'm thinking maybe we'll tap into one of these ones that's slightly further away and with um, not having any meteors around right now I think it's a good good time to take the further ones from us uh, okay let, let's let's see again that's that's a re rename change the skin research oh, complete. A white one. anomaly analyzed white. no it's a uh, it's a bit of yellow there as well and oh there we go bend now 1250 beautiful and the gene ad adap uh, adaption <laughs> is done as well let's check the check the farm over here and what do we get we got some you know uh, average yields but grows fast and no i think the one we wanted to go for is probably Sector some fruit scan. trees next and then I'm thinking... Oh, should we just keep it on fruit trees? Because I think the yield... Is almost the same anyways. I mean... I suppose it's a little bit better, but... Then again, if we're not reducing the... Soil quality... I think it sort of works out then. Um, okay. This one's done... Let's let's have a quick look at our research again. Uh, now, water conser water conservation system, water consumption of tomes reduced by fifty percent. That is very beautiful too. Um, not really sure what we what we want to go for next. Decorations have increased service comfort, and they're all so expensive now. So we've gotta be careful. I think. Um, I may also want to... Actually, I know what I want. I want the drone hub. You know, we want the... RC, since there's so many resources, let's have the RC transport um, bring more with each time. And I think that makes it also faster. Yeah, faster and increases storage. Okay. Good. Good. Things, things are starting to look a lot better. Now... Let's see, we've got ooh, only one housing space left in here. Oh, that's because this is full. I think it will be good time to start building another tome now. Yes, I do. Resources and are low. Okay. Are we going to have enough reserves to go for fruit trees? Sector scanned. I don't know. But since, hmm, well, maybe we'll do another another soybeans, and then we'll go into fruit trees. Let, let's do that. So we'll further increase the breakthrough discovered. Uh, one second. So we'll further increase the uh, our 
our our output and the last group um, last harvest we had was less just about 40 or less than 40 it, i don't think it was 45 so this should be the first bigger yield that we that we get now and the next one should go even higher since we get uh, the soil quality will be 92 percent so yeah let's do it this way let's do complete um, two soybean harvest first and then we'll go into into those beautiful apples or, or the fruit trees over here all right breakthrough let's check what is this about all colonists gain 20 percent plus 20 performance during night shifts hmm that's nice okay yeah um don't think we're gonna get that ex extractor ai and at the same time um although i really wanted it i mean now that we do have um humans uh, on on mars i think maybe it's best if we don't get that breakthrough at all because um what i'm trying to say here is once once we get the extractor ai that means we can just plop them down everywhere uh hook it up with power and we're not gonna you know um we're not gonna have to use colonist as much which is you know at the same time it makes the game a little bit more boring as well i think it's gonna be more fun where we we have to have oh talking too much uh let's turn you on totally forgot will increase so the power consumption should go down it did go down good now they're all covered yeah this isn't working can be repaired after afterwards well i think we should be fine yeah we're producing more than we need so not too worried uh, supportive community okay that's fine i think i think we're just gonna save those and and by saying this i've just realized we've, we've been playing this uh, episode for quite a while so let's uh, let's finish this one over here and we, we've got uh, quite a bit done in this episode as well especially with the research and uh, and having five billion in the bank now getting uh, battered by those meteors so it's it's been a fun episode um so once again thank you very much for joining and watching and all for, for all those comments as well and uh, and i do hope to see you in the next one take it easy